this Friday, November 10th, around 6.30 p.m. Eastern Time, also market time. Let's take a look at the, uh, so what happened, guys? Well, <laughs> we had this mega push, right? A sell-off into a dip buy and then this. So now, when I left off yesterday, I said, like, don't chase the bottom. And this is why you don't want to chase the, the bottom of the range. Because the bottom of the range can be just a perfect dip buy. Because we are bullish. And this could just take us to the next, uh, to the next leg of, uh like level up right above this area so let's just take a look at the intraday and see how we played out now <clears throat> yesterday we had this huge sell-off and then this consolidation and then this little pop here and in here in the open pretty much it was nice it was a nice short here right now whoever didn't cover in this area well they pretty much got destroyed here. I think a lot of people are piloting short here, thinking that this will double top here and just sell off hard, but they just got pretty much like a mega bear trap right here. Everybody got bear trapped and then this got pushed to the edge. And this is pretty interesting because Fridays usually like to sell off on super bullish, but we did have a bearish day yesterday and then today we saw a uh, Today we counteracted that, so basically we just got bear trapped in this area here if you didn't sell for short term, right? And that's why you got to take profits here. It's a good example, like if you're short here, if you're short here, and you're not taking profits here, well, you're probably, you know, you're risking seeing something like this. And also if you're shorting here while well, you're risking seeing something like this. So that's why you, you pretty much have to uh, short into into strength, especially on a setup like this. But right now we're like super bullish. And now it just makes me think that a lot of bears got uh, trapped. And for that reason, we're probably going to push a little bit more before we sell off. But even, and with that being said, like, we're pretty much every single day ready to get sold off hard, right? So, is that going to be Monday? I don't know. It might be Tuesday or Wednesday, something like that. But it could be Monday. We don't know. We'll see how, like, the market opens because now there's, like, a the weekend, right? And there's going to be time for people to uh, pretty much reassess their strategy. And, uh, yeah. Yeah this uh, we'll we'll see we'll see are they gonna is there, it it all depends what the algos think if the algos think there's a lot of bears trapped then they're gonna squeeze them if if there's a lot of bulls but the bears are didn't get squeezed yet then we're gonna go up still more so yeah that's the way we're gonna have to play it gotta be really careful and just watch because right now, we could get a really nice squeeze. And when that squeeze happens, that's when you short. Yeah, I'm going to leave it as that. I hope you guys had a good week. Yeah, be safe. And uh, have a good weekend. I'll see you guys on Monday.